Gypsy Christine on YouTube for everything sailing, the lifestyle and travel, the realities of the sailing lifestyle, food, cooking, scuba diving, spear fishing, all the shit that we do. Please subscribe to Sailing Gypsy Christine. Please subscribe. Thank you. Subscribe to Sailing Gypsy Christine on YouTube for all my crazy sailing adventures. Not all because I can only capture so much. And traveling on a sailboat. Thank you for subscribing. My name is Christine and I've been a gypsy and a hobo for maybe 12 years. All about being a gypsy and a hobo and traveling on a very limited budget. Please subscribe. Thank you. So, all my channels, no, all my videos are very spontaneous. I don't really plan it that much, and as you can see, I look like this most of the time. Very messy, like a hobo. So, the realities of life is what I show on my videos. So sometimes I look good. Most of the time I look messy and tired because that's how I look in normal life. So I'm a very lazy vi video person. And on YouTube, I'm super busy. Currently I'm in the Philippines. Very slow Wi-Fi. It took me maybe three minutes. Oh no, a seven-minute video it took me three hours to upload on Vimeo and YouTube. So a lot of people are asking where I'm at. I'm maybe two and a half years behind on my videos, but thank you for asking and watching my channel. It's probably like the most unprofessional. Um, just spontaneous channel because I don't have time to plan stuff. So I'm blessed to have a helper to help me with all my videos. So right now what I'm doing is I gave him two and a half years of backlogged pictures and videos since Australia. I'm still at Australia somewhere. So he's fortunate that he's retired and he's interested in helping me get my videos and my travels out on YouTube. So thank you, thank you, you know who you are. Who you are. I can't say who it is, Anonymous. So he is helping me put my videos together. So even though my videos might be a little different because I use different music and grammar-wise, but it's my helper. So, but he's fortunate enough to have time to do all this for me. So thank you, thank you, thank you. So that's where I'm at. So these videos are being compiled by him because he knows me that it'll probably take me five years to get all this shit together. So this is me here and now, but a lot of the videos you will be seeing is backlogged since Australia, which is maybe three years ago. So I'm maybe two and a half, three years behind. So that's why it, it looks confusing, but if you look at the time frame, I was in Australia three years ago. Then we went to Indonesia. We sailed to Indonesia. We spent six months there. And then Paul and I sailed to the Philippines. And we just completed one season in the Philippines. And we plan on staying another season because it's a great country. They speak English. It's cheap because we're on a limited budget. So hopefully um, my helper can catch up with a lot of the videos and uh, do current videos. So now we have more of a plan on me sending him more current information. So this might be confusing for you guys. So it's gonna be like back, forth, back, forth, um, past, future, oh, present, past, 
present. So hopefully you guys can keep up and it's sort of like a mind game. So that's where I'm at. I'm a gypsy hobo, so I'm unplanned, unorganized, but hopefully we get more videos out. And thank you for watching because YouTube has closed down many channels, so it's hard to get momentum going. But anyone, thank you for watching my crazy travels. Thank you. My helper, since he's compiling all the videos, I have a lot of very fuzzy. I'm not a professional, I'm amateur. And even to get videos, it's very hard because we're moving. So a lot of my uh, videos may be blurry and not good quality. So my helper, what he's doing now, is putting in a lot of pictures. So I take um, more pictures than I do videos because I can't be constantly filming myself. And Paul is not a good help because he forgets too. So I'm doing most of it by myself. So my helper is taking a lot of my pictures, either left or right. It's his creative vision and putting it in footage where it might be blurry, confusing, bad weather, or anything that could happen in videos. So that's why you're going to be seeing a lot of my pictures because I actually started out taking mostly pictures. And I think most people know me for my pictures because that's what my hobby and passion is, um, are, not videos. But I started to do videos, so many of my followers or subscribers have first known me because of my nude, naked art. So on YouTube, I have been shut down and all my channels, maybe six, seven, I. Me and my helper, we just can't stay open. Even though I promote and advocate non-sexual nudity and naturism. But for some reason, we get uh, people complain and we've been shut down maybe seven or eight times. So now, we're just gonna focus for YouTube, traveling and sailing. Just to share that side of my life. So, and a lot of pictures you're not seeing sexual naturism. So if you want to see more pictures like uncensored, go to Vimeo. It's free.